Just a day after raiders attacked and killed four people in Lososia and Kom areas of Samburu East District, residents laid to rest the bodies of the deceased at the scene of the deadly attacks. At the scene, livestock killed during the fire exchange later at the ground. Heavily armed cattle rustlers attacked Manyatas in the area on Tuesday night, just two weeks after raiders attacked the villages and killed three people and escaped with 800 heads of cattle. <laughs> And today in Nairobi, professionals and members of the Burana community held demonstrations to protest against increasing cases of insecurity in the area. The demonstrators making stopovers at the president's office, the prime minister's office and the police headquarters demanded that the issue of insecurity be addressed immediately. They gave the police and the minister of internal security seven days to act. Juzi tulipatisha katiba, na hiyo katiba kwetu ilipata 99% support. Na hiyo katiba kweli leo ina to protect ama apana. Kwa sababu tuliambiwa hiyo katiba ina protect maisha ya binadamu. Na sisi siyo binadamu ama ni nini? Kama sisi apana chungwa kama mwananchi ya Kenya, tutachukua sheria mkononi, tutachukua haki yetu na kujikinga. Those killed in the Sunday attacks were three men and one woman. Two of those killed were a couple. Isiolo residents blame security officers deployed in the area of Lagziti. They say no action was taken even after the previous attacks that took place two weeks ago. The victims of the latest attacks are said to have gone to Samburu East to look for pasture for their livestock following the current drought. Members of parliament drawn from the area blamed the internal security ministry for neglecting the region despite many cases of cattle rustling. Angel Katusia KTN Prime.